The following segment is sponsored by Cooper Vision. Children's lifestyles have drastically changed with less outdoor play and more screen time than ever before. At the same time, myopia, where the eye grows too long and causes nearsightedness, is reaching epidemic levels, affecting 36% of all kids as of 2023. This also puts kids' long-term eye health at risk. Let's learn more about what can be done. Joining us now is Dr. Felicia Timmerman. Welcome to the show. Thank you so much. I appreciate you guys having me. Yes, of course. So Dr. Timmerman, you are the expert. Why is childhood myopia becoming so common and what role is the changing lifestyle of children playing? Over the past decade, we've seen a dramatic change in the lifestyle of how children are living their everyday lives with that increase in digital device use as well as less time spent outdoors, which are key contributors to the development and progression of myopia. Now myopia, otherwise known as nearsightedness, is when the eye is growing too long, too fast, and causing blurrier vision as this happens. Now this can impact the overall athletic as well as academic performance of children and also contribute to eye complications later in life, such as retinal detachment and glaucoma development. Okay, interesting. Now what are the causes and warning signs of this? Warning signs that parents may notice are their child struggling to identify objects out in the distance. So many times children will squint, they'll move more closely to the objects such as a television, or they may note more frequent headaches or avoidance of tasks. So if parents do notice these signs or symptoms, it's very important to get the children in for a comprehensive eye exam with their eye care provider. Okay, good to know. Now, are there any treatment options that can help? Good news, there's an FDA approved product, the MySight One Day Contact Lens, the first and only FDA approved treatment to slow the progression of myopia in children at eight to 12 years old at the initiation of treatment. Now this is a soft daily disposable contact lens. So children are gonna get great vision with it, just like they would get in standard contact lenses or glasses. But it's also gonna slow down that progression of myopia due to the embedded technology within it. So it's gonna provide the child great vision, treatment, as well as contact lenses to live an active lifestyle. Yes, this is amazing news. How cool is that? Okay, and for parents that are concerned, what else can they be doing? Really lifestyle modifications of trying to reduce or minimize that recreational digital device use. So for non-academic purposes, as well as increasing outdoor time. So 90 minutes or more of outdoor play, it's greatly beneficial for children to prevent, delay, or slow the progression of myopia. Additionally, making sure that the children are always receiving those annual eye exams from their optometrist or ophthalmologist for early diagnosis and treatment of this condition. Okay, good to know. Where can someone go for more information and resources? Yeah, outside of the eye care provider, they can go to the MySight website. That's MySight, M-I-S-I-G-H-T dot com to learn more about myopia, the MySight One Day Contact Lens, and also how to find an eye care provider in their community. Fantastic. Thank you for all this information, Dr. Timmerman. Great to see you. Have a wonderful day. Thank you so much.